Good morning and welcome back to Posh Cat's Cabin and Happy New Year. This is the first outing of uh, 2020. It's the 3rd of January and uh, as you know we are all year round campers. Looking outside it's a little bit dark and damp out there this morning. Um, we're on a rally. It's with the Suffolk Centre of the Caravan and Motorhome Club. Mill House public house in Saxted and it's about two miles from Framlingham in Suffolk. Well I'm glad to say that we're back at the Saxted Green Post Mill. It's um, a real fine example of an 18th century mill. Uh, it's undertaken a fair bit of restoration over the years but still stands in the original position and uh, we can take a look from outside. It's not open at this time of the year. Just talking to the gentleman who owns the site and uh, he was saying that there's more restoration going on at the moment and uh, really nice to see the sails back on. Last year, I'll show you a picture of last year's uh, mill when uh, the sails were off and they were being repaired. As you can see, a lovely area. Suffolk is very flat. We're all parked out in the car park at the pub here. We're all, there's quite a group of us. Now we're gonna take a walk down to Framlingham. There's Karen and Tony in front of us. Got the rabble behind me. And here we go, about two miles, so uh, we'll wander along and if we see anything of interest we'll stop and take a few pictures. There is parking here at the castle, as you can see it's fairly tight. This is a Saturday and uh, it's only open, the castle's only open at weekends so it's uh, for motorhomes you have to have the luck on your side the castle inn lovely for a beer and uh, I do have a good selection of ales and food in there I've not been in today but uh, we have in the past and it's got a good reputation and here we are again at Framlingham Castle Here we are. Thank you. <coughs> All right. You have to press one and the green thing. Okay. And that takes round. Thank you.
We're up on the castle wall now, looking out towards Brandeston. And Brandeston Hall is over in the distance there, the other side of the lake. That's a private school. And you're looking across the countryside, Suffolk countryside here, from the walls of the castle. Framlingham Castle. It's a bit of a cold, stiff breeze on this January afternoon, but it's certainly worth a look. It's £10 admission and uh, for an adult, and there's um, a free guided tour, an audio tour as well, which is well worth it. And uh, we're just looking around here from the walls of the castle, and uh, you can it's a clear day, you can see for miles, it's really pretty. Um, despite the trees being bare and uh, the wind is pretty cold. Let's have another look.
A what? A caramel slice. A caramel slice. I'm the only one eating. And a cappuccino? Yes. Coffee? Yeah. And I've got a green tea. A view from the outside of the castle. It's quite spectacular with the moat surrounding. There's no water in the moat at this part. I think some of it has um, water in it. It's a little bit wet down here, I have to say, but in the true sense of the word. Um, there's the mirror across there. And uh, Sue is slippery sliding up the hill. <laughs> Bit of a muddy trail through there. Oh well. In for a penny, in for a pound, they say, don't they? What's happened then, Sue? <laughs> made it worse. Uh, oh. And in your best boots as well. Classic shot of uh, Framlingham Castle from this angle. We're just taking a walk round the back end here. Well, there is a lovely walk through the mere down this little path. We have been down there before, but it's pretty wet. And the girls are all chuckling away there because they're saying that we're checking an out. But I think we're going to just walk around this side of the castle here and avoid the the boggy wetness of the uh, the mere walk today. Still lovely though. You see the families are enjoying it around here, climbing the the bank. Imagine trying to scale the walls. I always imagine climbing it, but uh, not with yeah. people firing arrows at me. Yeah, that's right, yes. Sir.